what is up so real gang how are we doing now let's get into the video so ray so wavy just posted on twitter and stated that lindasia is pregnant guys <gasps> oh my god I, I mean i ain't gonna lie y'all I haven't been seeing her going out to the club a lot lately. She's been chilling, her and Ray. They've been doing their thing and they've been getting to the bag. But Ray did come back a few minutes later and did say that she is lying and she's just practicing for when she does get pregnant. You know, earlier this year, Ray and Deja had stated on Twitter that they had wanted to have kids. A lot of people want come on let's be real a lot of people knew deja wanted to have a kid with ray i already know deja was gonna have a kid with ray that's the only person deja is gonna have a kid for deja doesn't want to have kids anymore but for ray she will now ray did say next year she wants to be married and she wants to have kids so like she said she's just practicing for that but i do believe by the rate they're going and how healthy this relationship looks you know i think they can get there you also, you know, it's, 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 it's good when a relationship can take a break. Like it sucks because, you know, you always have those up and downs and in those rough moments where, you know, we bringing each other down, we fight in or, you know, whatever. It'd be a lot going on, especially when you really love each other. I think the relationship just be a lot. It really be intense. So just to see all of that has transpired in the beginning of the year, you know, we were keeping up on that and now they are back here. I just love it. Like I'm, I'm a lover girl. So like I said, I'm all for it. If Ray's applying that pressure and she's doing what she needs to do to show this woman that she loves her, y'all have no choice but to respect that. You know what I'm saying? saying and they're doing the work the relationship has been so healthy they're keeping their drama off of the internet we don't know what they got going on all we see is them building with each other loving it on each other and just being there for each other you know what i mean like i'm all for that so shout out to them maybe she is pregnant y'all and they just trying to you know like tell us but they're not really tell us and then when when when, when she really like baby shower time then they're gonna be like oh surprise like no, bitch, I remember that tweet, Ray. Don't play with me. Blueface and Jadine is pretending as if he's on a date with another girl. He was like, oh, he's going on a date or whatever. But let's be honest. I don't think he's going out with nobody else but Jadine, okay? I finally scored me a date, man. Let's go. I got me a little, a little west side. I'm going to pull up on him, take her out on a little date. This is my little fit check. I'm gonna get fly for the Oh yeah, so uh, you know, how's the steak? Well done. Well done, okay. Mm -hmm. You come here often? You ever been here before? No, this is my first time. Okay. I like well, you know, it here. I haven't been dating for a while, you know, I've just been This is your first date? Yeah. In a while. Since I left my my fiance. Well she left me, but hmm. Yeah, I don't want to talk about that bitch though. Fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. Yeah, like. So, um, uh, <laughs> you fuck on the first date or not? Because I do, but like, I'm just totally kidding. Mmm, we can't. We can go to my place. Oh, yeah? You into that? But you guys know the other day he was going back and forth with soldier boy and stating how he slept with soldier boy baby mother right before the baby shower well soldier boy baby mother went to twitter and stated that she got her lawyers to send Blueface and his lawyers a cease and desist because he's been talking bad about her and trying to slander her name Comment down below, guys, and let me know how you feel about that. Honestly, I really believe ever since Krishan really officially left him, I think he's just been going, you know, spiraling out of control. I think that he really like her. And, you know, you know when a narcissist can't control you, they don't know what the hell to do. They're just acting out. They're wild and they're emotional. And this is just what he is. That's what he's doing. I think he's a narcissist. And I honestly think that he missed Krishan and he wants her, you know, to give him that attention because she's not feeding it to him. So he's like, I got to get it from somewhere else or I got to make myself seen so she can, you know, either write me, ask me, am I OK? Or just, you know, write me and tell me she missed me and she want to come back around. I think that's what the you know, I, I, that's what it's given for me. But comment down below. Let me know how you guys feel. Let's get into Carmen and Michi. They both just posted a video, but in Michi's video, he stated that Carmen won so crazy in love. He stated that she was the winner and honestly, she just conducted herself as a whole wife. So that is why she won the game. 
and he sees that quality in her, you know, and he stated that they were about to go out on a date. Y'all really act like y'all know who was gonna win, bro. That's crazy. But yeah, so as y'all can see, Carmen, the goddamn winner of So Crazy in Love season one. Man, hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie, bro. She OC. I ain't gonna lie, she OC. I'm super happy. I ain't gonna cap, bro. Like, I, man, y'all seen it, bro. Y'all seen it, bro. Y'all seen it, bro. I ain't even got to say nothing, bro. She a white, bro. I feel like she a white, bro. It is what it is. And that they did. And he just wanted to, you know, catch up with her, see how she's feeling, see how she feels about him and just where they're at and everything like that. And guys, I'm not going to lie. They were talking and they were just vibing and the vibe was just vibing. I'm not going to lie, y'all. They was getting me hot. <laughs> like They was getting me so hot. I was like, I can't even watch this no more because this is so cute. I love the chemistry. It's so natural. You could just tell that the, you know, the sexual tension is there too. Like, I think that's there. I think the chemistry, he, he keeps complimenting her. She's complimenting him and they're able to do work and do business together. I think this is a great um you know relationship for the both of them and let's just stay tuned let's keep supporting them and let's just see how far this go i think carmen definitely needs this and she's enjoying herself and she deserves that she's been through the worst with that other man you know what i'm saying other boy can't even say he a man because he should have never been treating her like that but i think she deserved this michi's being so gentle and so sweet and guys i just don't even want to talk about it no more i'm i'm gonna I'm be staying tuned because I didn't really keep up with Carmen and Corey, but I would definitely keep up with Carmen and Michi. Like, I love them. Yeah. I'm hot shit. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. Why make you nervous? Mm -hmm. You make me nervous? Mm -hmm. I do. Let me prime um, when you did it for a case. So, oh at this point, you can't even lie anymore. Listen, hey, look, I don't know if it's nervous. I, I don't think it's nervous. I think it's, you know, you just, make, yeah, you just make me feel good. Yeah, you make me feel good. Mm -hmm. I'm happy around you. You feel me? That's a good thing. It's a good thing. I like when I can hear your accent sometimes. My accent? Yeah, like you do have an accent. And I can hear it sometimes. I am. What type it's of accent is that? It's, it's, it's OZ? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, shut the fuck up. Yo, shut the fuck up. What the fuck? Yo. Oh I finally scored me a date, man. Let's go. I got me a little, a little west side. I'm going to pull up on him, take her out on a little date. This my little fit check. I'm gonna get fly for the for the uh for the little west side, so you know she can be impressed and maybe wanna fuck me after. You know, maybe have a little sex. Maybe I move her. Nah, this bitch too bad. Cause I gotta come harder than that. I gotta come harder than that. And that's why I'm gonna get me some booty tonight. Singing that, uh, singing that song, you know, it is. Dad. Dad. I ain't beat my dick tonight. You hear me? Huh? I can wish me luck, man. I got my house clean and everything just to uh, impress this little tenderoni. Oh yeah, good look at pops. No love, no love. But you know what they say, man. When they, if, if she make it back to Blue's Palace, she better be giving head from here to Dallas. You know, or, or she's going to get kicked like a callus. Oh, that's yeah. Oh, yeah. So, uh, you know, how's the steak? Well done. Well done, okay. Mm -hmm. You come here often? You ever been here before? No, this is my first time. Okay. I like well, you know, here. I haven't been dating for a while, you know, I've just been... This is your first date? Yeah. In a while? Since I left my, my fiance. Well, she left me, but... Hmm. Huh. Yeah. I don't want to talk about that bitch, though. Fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. Yeah, like... So, um, uh, <laughs> do you fuck on the first date or not? Because I do, but, like, I'm just totally kidding. Mm, we can't. We can go to my place. Oh, um, yeah? You into that? This what your refrigerator look like when you ain't got no bitch. I'm dating, though. Come on, catch me a fish. That was the full video of Blueface on his little date with Jadine and the 
her being the anonymous little girl, whatever the case may be. But make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And leave them comments down below and let me know how you guys feel about this video. Like I said before, comment down below. Let me know who you guys want me to react to, what you want to see.